to our algebra one uh, the topic is uh, solve quadratic equations using square roots um, uh, as a example we have uh, one problem here um, solve for r r squared is equals one so before to solve uh, our problem let me remember you something um, uh, for instance if a quadratic equation uh, like um, ax squared plus bx squared plus c equals zero has no like this has no uh, bx term you can solve by um, Uh, by isolating x squared, right, and the square root. All right, with this concept, so we are able to find the answer in our problems for the topic today. Okay, so next step uh, is a solve for r. Uh, if we have here r is squared equals 1, just write um, r equals um, positive or negative square root and 1. So this is uh, take the square root, the square. Take the square root, that's the, the, the step. Uh, next step are, will be equals, uh, square root number one is positive or negative one. All right, this is simplify. Simplify, all right? So the answer is um, r is equals one or r is equals negative one, all right? That's the solution for this problem. So let's uh, try to solve another problem. Let's uh, find another example. Let's solve for, uh, in this case, for b. All right. So b is squared equals 64. All right. So next step here as in b will be cos positive or negative square root number uh, 64, right? Here, you know the step, take the square, square root. So next step, simplify, it's positive or negative. Uh, here, uh, square root 64 is eight, okay? It's uh, simplify. All right, uh, so the uh, answer would be um, a, b equals eight, and then or b equals negative eight. See, it's very simple, our topic. It's algebra one for um, for high school. Okay, let's go and then solve uh, one more, one more example, okay? One more. So now solve for, um, solve for n. Uh, our problem is uh, n squared equals 25. Right? It's very simple topic. So next step, n is equals uh, positive or negative uh, square root uh, no, 25. So take here the square root. Take the square root. So next step, simplify it's, uh, positive or negative uh, 5. The square root of 25 is, is 5. Very simplify. Right? So our answer is n is equals 1, 5, or n equals negative 5. Right? So very simple topic for algebra. Okay?